Hey guys, what's up? So today we're going to take a look at one of our more interesting special needs buses. So this is bus 60. Now it started its life out as 1198 for our uh, county uh, DD, which is uh, Developmental Disabilities. But at the same time, so you can see here where it said county, but at the same time it was also a late ball bus. I don't know the exact um, story behind how that works, or how that worked, but um, this was ordered for the Board of DD, but it was bought by Laidlaw, some kind of, I don't know. My guess is that Laidlaw probably took over transportation for the county, and then when Laidlaw, um, when we got out of the contract with First Student, the county stopped providing bus servicing and all that kind of stuff. So. Yeah, but the interesting thing about 60 here is that it's a full-size bus, and it's got a lift. And we got the small, small wheels, obviously. Um, and then here you should be able to see 1198, the shadow. But yeah, that's that's the back. And this is a 2005, so that means it's got a VT365 because it's a 200, which is kind of unfortunate. So, yeah, and then you can definitely see the shadow of 1198 there, but this bus is, in a sense, very similar to 59, because it's a full-size bus, but it's a handy bus. So, and here's the CE200 emblem, um, but, but the one big difference with 60 is that 60 has no mounted seats so all these seats are on rails and all these seats can be removed or added and as you can see it's it's literally a 77 passenger body with wheelchairs and removable seats so this would have been our first 72 passenger second gen even though it is not a full 72 passenger bus um there's the child check button so, I mean, this bus is just interesting to me. It always has been. It will never not be interesting to me just with how big it is and just the specs. You've got the wonderful grayish-blue seats and um, air conditioning. Got your cameras, which I honestly didn't know there was a camera over there. That's interesting. Um, and then this bus, I'm pretty sure, was built in November of 04. Yep, 11-22-04. Um, and then there's your driver's area, switch panels, or switch panel, not panels. Um, and yeah, I mean, this is just an interesting bus, and it even has an asset number, which, interesting thing, the asset number has nothing to do with the number 1198. My guess is that 1198 was a board of DD given now number. I don't know where any of those high numbers came from, because all three, or no, all four of these 05s that we have, it was like... 1189, 1190, 1195, 1198. So I'm sure, I, I think there were actually more um, that we don't, you know, I don't know, first student probably took them from us, but there were probably more of these at one point. Um, but like I said, I just think this is an interesting bus. It's not something you see a lot of just in the specking. And, you know, honestly, if you look at this bus, you can tell it was ordered by Laidlaw Transit because spec-wise, this body with the exception of it being a handy bus is and a second gen is identical to 50 like it's got you know no window tint no white roof the gray seats the flooring is even the same color like it's it's almost identical except for the fact that this is a 2005 it's a second gen um i honestly don't know where i was going um i got interrupted by a phone call so uh, i'm picking the video back up but basically what i was saying just a minute ago was it's identical to 50 it has like it's an 05 different engine you know it's a little it's one window longer but pretty much you can tell this is a laid law ordered bus like if you if this bus had changeable signs uh, it, it there would be no no doubting that this bus was ordered by laid law transit um but that's i mean that's pretty much it um here oh, i already showed the front didn't i but, you know, we'll, we'll look at it again, I guess. Um, but that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. Um, let me know what you think. Do you think this bus is interesting? 
like I do, or am I just in my own world here? I don't know. Uh, but with that being said, yeah, thanks for watching.